Hey everybody, welcome back. I hope you've all been well. So I thought I would share with you just a few of um, some lip combos that I've been really enjoying um, and maybe you could get some nice ideas. Just excited to show you guys because I think um, like a lot of these lip combos um, are, you know, I mean you can wear them any time of the year I guess. I don't think there's really any rules but I, I will wear them any time of the year whether it's winter autumn summer spring it doesn't matter so um and our winters don't get very cold here so a lot of people still in thongs and flip-flops and shorts so um the first one i wanted to share with you is one that i'm wearing right now and it's more of a coral um combo so um i've been laying off lip liners for a while now and i've been just sticking with um you know more lipsticks um, and just trialing um, without wearing any liners but with this lip combo I've been wearing a liner just to set it as a base so um, I'll show you it is um, a YSL lipstick and out of all the YSL lipsticks um, I don't like the Rouge Volups um, I don't like the pearls um, I haven't yet tried the glossy stains the um, the balmy ones or the shines but out of all of what I've tried from YSL these are my favorite and this is the Rouge Pure Coutures and I have two of these and this is number 23 and 23 is just a um, gorgeous sort of light orangey sort of coral so hopefully the camera is going to pick that up and um, I'll swatch that this, the texture of this lipstick is um, quite nice. I really do enjoy it. So that's that one. And then the liner I wear with it is um, the Chanel Pesh. And I fill my lips in with this first. And Chanel liners, lip liners are definitely my favorite. So Pesh and um, the YSL lipstick are pretty much similar. Pesh is a little bit, tiny bit deeper, which is good. It gives just a nice outline. So I fill my lips in with this and then the Glossomer, um, I love Glossomers, they're my favourite lip glosses. I definitely prefer these over the um, Dior Addix um, only because I love the sparkle and the dimension that it gives. It's just so, so pretty. So I'll swatch that one and this one is in number 146. So they're just, it's just as you can see really pretty lip combo um, and when applied over the lipstick it's just gorgeous I think a lot of you if you love like a, a coral orange tone then I think you'll really like this lip combo the next one is a little bit different um, I bought the L'Oreal Caress um, in 400 Eve the stains this one does not show up on my lips at all but I must say that once I apply it over something it brings out the color more so I've been using the Revlon um, Just Bitten Balm Stain in 001 Honey and my lips with the Shiseido um, lip liner and this is RS303 it's just um, a really nice sort of rosy pink same with the um, chub the I keep wanting to call it chubby stick the Revlon balm stain they're pretty much the same color can you see that and then when I and then I apply the caress over the top it just brings it out a lot more so I'll swatch it on its own it's very sheer so I apply this over the top and it just it's just a really nice um, sort of mauvey pink um, with a hint of lilac because of the um, stains so that's another one that I'm really enjoying the next one is um, this combo so it's a NARS sex machine lip pencil which is just again another rosy sort of pink shade so it's this one here and then over, so I fill my lips in with that. Then over the top, I use the um, Revlon Balm Color Balm in Cupcake, which is just a really pretty 
blue tone pink it's really sweet and I apply that right over the top so it kind of tones down the um, sex machine and um, I just kind of brightens it and then um, it gives it a bit of a gloss and then the Dior I've been using the Dior 153 um, lip gloss over the top of that and this is probably one of my favorite combos because it just turns out to be this really light sort of nude pretty pink color so love those the next one is a little bit tricky because a lot of people don't like um, the Stila um, sale day liquid lipsticks they are drying but I often wear a um, lip balm underneath wipe it off and then you know my lips can hold a little bit of the moisture for a little while while I wear this so um, the best thing to best way to wear it is to do that and to take off the lip balm otherwise this won't stay in the lips or you could use the lip balm underneath and just use this as like um a gloss over the top but it will um, slide around a lot so I wear this one it's just really thick it's a beautiful um, neutral dusty pink and then over the top when once this sets and dries it loses its glossiness um, but the way to disguise the you know the dry crackly part of this whole um, lipstick liquid lipstick is I use like um, a sort of gel dense um, lipstick or a lip gloss over the top and I use the Stila Color Balm and this is in L E L L E and what that does is just disguises that um, you know that sort of dry crackiness of the the liquid lipstick so um, when this dries um, I can't put a swatch over the top but it just gives a really nice um, brightens it up a little bit and just sort of disguises that dryness of that lipstick so I really like that combo and um, the Stila Color Balms are brilliant lipsticks I love um, how dense um, and moisturizing the formula is really really nice formula reminds me of the Dior Dix but these are um, a lot more rich in pigmentation okay so the lucky last lip combo is um, it's another YSL Rouge Pure Couture lipstick and this one is in number 10 um, it's a beautiful nude sort of rosy sort of color it's really really pretty and um, I'll swatch that one for you so beautiful and then I wear or I line my lips with the MAC it's very much a similar color and this is subculture liner this one pulls a little bit more um, brown the liner but it just it all ties in nicely together so that's subculture this lip gloss over the top and I love this color this is called pink fade by Mac it's just a creamy baby pink I wear that over the top and then in the center of the lips you can see that in the center I'll either wear um, these are both similar products this is Chanel Galactic Glossomer and this is um, Bobbi Brown Shim High Shimmer Lip Gloss they both turn out similar on the lips they're both that really nice um, high shine sort of sparkle to the lips so they both have similar effect I just apply that right in the center of the lips so really beautiful combo and I'll apply this separate on its own so you can see just see how pretty that sparkle is it's so gorgeous so they're the lip combos that I've been switching up between lately and having fun playing with and um, I really enjoy those um, comment below what your favorite lip combos are and I hope you enjoyed that video I hope you have a wonderful week and I will speak to you soon bye